Hello everybody, McGrayer here, and welcome back to another episode of Terror Tech, and today, I made a tiny little tank, but that, well, packs a big punch. As you can see, it has a lot of these, um, Hawkeye Cruise Missiles, which are pretty much my favorite weapon in the game, because they deal so much damage, and they have a fairly good blast radius. So, this tech just dropped down over here, and we're going to murder it! So what I like about it is it goes through shields, like it damage things behind shields just because of its blast radius. Uh oh, uh oh, I don't have much protection in the back for this thing. Alright, there we go. Truth be told, though, I was designing another tech and it failed miserably. <laughs> I was trying to make a mech. And I was having problems with the legs and with it standing up. But, uh, it was a fairly simple design, but. Ooh. Oh, oh, you're gonna be a good test. Actually, both of you. Wait. Oh, that's, 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 that's Mike. I don't really want to help you. No. Ow. Wee, go airborne. Yeah, I was trying to make a mech. Uh, of course, it didn't have walkable legs or anything like that because well there are no legs in this game although I have seen somebody make legs I think in their research and development thing I don't actually have that there go boom there you go oh I'm just exploring right now. Hey, baddies. Yup. I like the flamethrower. Boom! I'm wondering what would it be like if I. You shot up. Alright. I just wanted to test that. Oop. Outrun this! Oh no! There you go. Boop, boop, boop. Uh, nothing that I really need in there. But, you know what? Might as well pick it up anyways. Let's put you down right about there. And boom. There's another tech over there. Another one up there. They don't look too, too strong. I haven't ran into, um, I remember in earlier versions, you used to get invaded by massive, massive techs. I haven't seen them 
uh, since I started playing this series. And I'm kind of sad about that. Uh, I need power. I see you all the way over there. Okay, time to recharge my batteries. And yeah, I'll be back. Actually, I should turn this also into a tech. It's a little way to recharge myself. I'll be back! All right, let's take him out. Wee! Oh no! I didn't really get to see what happened. I want to see if it's a big tech or, you know, I want something to lag my computer. That's what I want. <gasps> You're a big boy. Look at you. I'm not going to comply. You got big guns! You had big guns! I am disappointed in you. Not my tech, it did well. This thing. Mm. Nothing really, you know. Screams out at me here, but you might as well pick it all up. Just gonna despawn otherwise. I have thought about making. I'm thinking like a laser tech. Something that's meant to more like. accurately take down an enemy instead of just blowing them up. Although I like blowing them up. You don't make as much money when you blow them up. But it's a lot more fun when you blow them up. Boom! So. <laughs> yeah. You need a lot of... I think a lot of lasers. They don't work very well against... Um, shields. Once the shields are down... It's because they, they're so precise. They... They help, you know, like... Preserve the tech. Ooh, yay. Your guns don't reach me. Mine reach you. Alright. Time to look for more trouble. Alright, there's another tech out over there. Ow! I like how ramming into it produces uh, gems. <laughs> I haven't. I've ran into a whole bunch of tiny techs. Nothing really big. That oh, looks kind of cool. I'm just killing for sport right now. Bam! That was a hard landing. I wish I could put these missile launchers on the side. They just flop to the ground if you do that. Here's our base. Hmm. 
I still have to um, get some more um, mines all over the place here. You know what? Let's just go to Crafty Mike. Let's see. I think he is going to talk about uh, one of the component upgrades. You know, for like manufacturing and all that. Hey, Mike. Long time no see. Oh, no, not a bandit. You know, I probably have it on me. Yep. I know about them. One reason why I don't have my, uh, my manufacturing base uh, anymore is because it sometimes will bug out and stuff will just kind of loop forever and ever and ever and ever and ever and not actually use the stuff so oh, I click It is as easy as that. Oh, I don't want to hunt for resources. You suck, Mike. Why did I just give you the part? Are you big baddie? No. No. Chico. Put you out of your misery. Okay, I am back at our base and that big guy is there. But I got some more um some of the parts I was missing for the uh, for little miners. So I was mentioned. Uh, somebody told me that there was one underneath. I think this ramp here. Ah, this one. There we go. Ooh, that one's gonna be hard to get to. Assemble! Boop. No. Yes! Damn it! trees Probably get away with just putting, um, just, uh, just like one miner there, but 
I won't do that for this. Not right now. Alright, let us pick you back up. There you go. Let's see now. Oh, here's one. I built these fairly low to the ground. I see you, Tech, over there hiding. Touching it. There you go. something over here. Anchored furnace. Yeah, I don't use the anchored furnaces uh, that much at all. I, I, I might have one. Oh, I do have one of these. I, I, I might have one. Um, on a, on a non-mobile base, like, like my main base, but I, I don't think it's really needed. And pick you back up. Join in on the baby fight. And we beat those babies. Yes. I'm gonna put down one more. I really need it. Not much, actually. All right, let me go get the parts and let's find a new spot. Well, look at that. That thing is just covered in wheels. <laughs> Now it's covered in explosions. Man, I can't wait to get rid of this cough. My kids keep getting me sick. I think it's because they keep eating stuff off the floor or something. I don't know. Maybe I should stop feeding them cat food or something. <laughs> All right, let's see. All right, no. Let's go over here. Oh, you look cool. Very fragile, but cool. Okay, now I know there's some more... There's another node. Actually, well, there, there's a whole bunch of them. So one over here. I think there is one over here. An orange one. I think the orange ones are worth quite a bit. Is that red? I'm colorblind. You know what? Let's just solve this by summoning you. Excuse 
me. Just, just chip away at it. Just put drills on this. Oh wait, no, 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 no. You might have been okay there. Yes. How much is this stuff worth? Do you know Leo? No? Okay. Let's see. I see well, Leo, you say his name and he just starts meowing. on you get no front legs oh you're still up guys i think that's gonna be it for this episode of terra tech i am gonna have to put in a lot more um more of these things i might make a third one just because now now we're starting to now i have to start buying stuff the reason why i was building these is because well i have all the parts so i might design another one to use something else that we have a lot of maybe with these AI sentries or something like that yeah I just don't want to buy all the parts so yeah anyways thank you all so much for watching this episode of Terra Tech if you have enjoyed don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe if you haven't already subscribed for more daily videos but yeah thank you all so much for watching and I'll see you all next time bye bye